This video is going to cover how you would download products from a from the CCA Gateway website and get those products into your QFloors product catalog. Now you must realize that you have to be a member of CCA uh, which is uh, a buying group. If you're not aware of what it is then you're probably not going to need to watch this video. Um, so first, the first step is you got to go onto the CCA Gateway website, and on there there is a place where you can define these are the products that I want to download and put into my QFlores program. We do not provide the training for that. That you will have to go to CCA for. Uh, call their helpline, and I'm sure that they can uh, support you and and helping guide you through the website and showing you how to do that. At some point it will tell you that you're going to download a file to your PC and or to your computer and that's what I've already done here. This file came from CCA and so now I have it on my local computer. This is what we call a zip file. It's all compressed. We have to uncompress the file and so you'll notice though that the files do have a date on them 04-18-2012 is, is this, uh, the second part of this name here. So if I double click on here, it'll ask me where I want to unzip the files to. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just tell it uh, to go back to the same folder, which is on the C drive, temp, and then I'm going to do boss. So this is the same folder that I'm using. Okay, shows me where it's going to unzip. Then I just press unzip. Now I have to type in the password. Now, the password CCA is also going to give you that password. Each file that you create has its own unique password, and and so you'll need to get that also from the CCA website. My understanding is sometimes it takes them a little while to generate that password, but they can also show you how to get that. Okay, so you need the file and the password. Those are the two things that you need. And then you type the password in. And you can see that it, once I did that, it added all of these files that came from the top file up here. Once I unzipped it, it had all these files inside. Really, the only one that you need to know about is the product file, the one that has an underscore product. That's the one that we're going to select in QFloors. We use all the rest, but you don't have to worry about any of the other ones. So after you get the files like this, so that you have these seven separate files, you're going to bring QFloors up. Then you're going to go to the file menu. Well, first of all, make sure that you have a CCA manufacturer in, in your catalog, which I don't think I do. So I'm going to create that. Okay, now I have somewhere where I can put those products. Okay, so I'm going to go to File, Import now, go down to CCA Gateway, and I have to search for the, that file that I just un, unzipped. So I go to Temp, Boss, and now I'm going to use the product file, okay, the one that says underscore product. I just double click on that. And this may take a while. Uh, I've noticed that because we have to sift through all those seven different files. I mean, depending on how big those files are, it c it could take quite a while. I I mean, it could even take 10 or 15 minutes uh, because we have to sort through all those different files. So make sure you be patient. Uh, you can see that now th those files that we downloaded had 436 styles and one uh, 10,681 colors. Um, if you do import remaining you'll be able to take a look and see what all these were. From this point it's the same uh, you bring them into QFloors the same way that you would um, on any B2B or CSV file transfers. If you're not sure to how to do that that's in another video and another training. That's all that needs to be done. Thanks.